Get off of that, Shakti. Don't knock it over. Shakti, can I see him? Yes. Stop knocking it over. Thanks for stopping by my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to talk to you about what it's like skateboarding again after taking 25 years off and being 36 instead of 11 or 12 years old. I felt like a complete beginner again. Aside from being able to ollie and ride a little bit, it definitely took a few weeks just to be able to feel comfortable on the board moving around again and then focusing on being able to all the up and down things and progressing each of those, trying to progressively all the up higher and higher curbs or ledges and then all laying down uh, banks and gaps. And I feel pretty good about the progress I was able to make in the first month. Now, when I was a kid, I didn't really have a plan for progressing. I would just look at what my friends were doing or um, come up with things on the spot to try. But I think what makes most sense to me is to get comfortable in every stance to try to create like a 360 degrees awareness of myself while I'm on the board. So in regular stance and switch stance, fakie and nolly, to be able to ollie in each of those stances. and to also be able to 180 both front side and back side. And that's something I've been focusing on getting comfortable with and something I work on each time I'm going outside. And then also uh, manualing, just getting comfortable on two wheels. I haven't tried nose manuals too much yet. I've been working on primarily getting just regular manuals down first. I watched a bunch of videos from the other 30 plus year old dudes skateboarding and it seems like the biggest challenge for myself or any of us is to do this consistently without getting injured so I think that'll be the biggest test. It looks like most guys within six months to a couple years blow a knee out or something like that and I think that I'll share videos in the future of the things I do to make sure my joints are staying strong and healthy and not overdoing it and not having any catastrophic injuries. I've had enough already and don't really plan on doing any more in my lifetime. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like and subscribe.